When we are children, we have this thing in our head that I call the meaning-making machine. And our meaning-making machine tries to grant meaning to everything that happens in our lives. Our mom or our dad yell at us or send us to a corner. And we may not necessarily get the meaning that they are trying to install on us. They may simply be trying to make us more disciplined. We may take on our own meanings. Mom wants me in a corner because I'm not important to her. Dad asks me to be quiet because he doesn't want to hear what I have to say, because what I say isn't important. Mom doesn't want to talk to me today because she doesn't love me. See, kids don't have adult brains. They are children. But this meaning-making machine creates these meanings that stick with them, infuse into them, and stay with them into adulthood. Some of the most common meanings, according to psychologists and, and therapists like Marissa Pierre or Shelley Lefko, are the ideas that I am not good enough, I am not important, I am not loved, what I have to say is not important. And these things hold us back in life. 